All right, guys, welcome to Rusty Duck Garage. Hey, we're on our way to pick up a 1988 uh, Chevrolet Camaro IROC Z28 uh, that uh, is on uh, Facebook Marketplace. Guy wants 3,500 bucks for it. Okay, here's a screenshot of the the ad that he wanted 3,500 dollars for the car and a picture that he had displayed to the car on the ad in Facebook Marketplace. Saw it there this morning and gave him the call and he said his uh, phone was blowing up but uh, I told him I would take the car, pay full price for it. It's about an hour and a half away from my house and I didn't have really anybody, it's a Friday, so I didn't really have anybody to go with me. The wife's at work and my uh, buddies are all at work and stuff, but, uh, and my trailer's not at home. So I talked to a good buddy of mine, Sean Gentry, and borrowed his truck and trailer and this uh, 60 Ford Power Stroke and trailer. And we're on our way up there to pick up this IROC Camaro. Hopefully the guy uh, comes through with a deal on it. He uh, he really likes the car. It's a runner driver and everything, but he wants a white one. So he's out looking at a white one right now while we're on the way to pick up this one. So hopefully we uh, get him to go through with a deal, but we're on the way there to pick her up now. Okay guys, here's the 1988 IROC C Camaro that we picked up up here in Gresham, Oregon. My buddy, Sean Gentry, loaned me his truck and his trailer pretty awesome of him so i could get up here before this guy got this car sold i think it's a pretty good buy uh it's no cherry but it's not bad shows uh 86 000 on the odometer it's been setting for many years had a bad fuel pump was sitting in the garage uh, this guy, guy i bought it from he picked it up uh two three years ago and put a fuel pump in it the fuel sending unit and got running he did a few other things there uh, but cosmetically, he really didn't do much to it, so that's that's what I'm gonna start in on. Um, you can see the front bumper cover there is a mess, uh, clear coat on the hood, and that sort of stuff. But it was a really nicely optioned car with the 5.7 liter uh, two port injection engine in it, and the interior is uh, it, it's definitely dirty and and uh, old, but it, it'll clean up halfway decent there, so. Uh, pretty excited to get it. 1988 Mullet Camaro. Uh, haven't really done anything much with it. Just uh, trying to clean it up, sort some things out. Got some scuff marks and all kinds of good stuff. But uh, I think overall it's gonna, not going to be a too bad a car when we get done with it. We'll, We'll uh, fix the paint on the bumper and the hood and one other area on the quarter over there and possibly the rear bumper, but just clean it all up, make it look a lot nicer. Okay, gave a quick wash job on the engine today. Uh, got the L98, tune port injected, 350. Uh, I took it, uh, just took some uh, Napa cells, what they call truck wash. Um, it's a, a caustic acid, I believe, and uh, sprayed it down with that and really, really made a lot of difference on it. It's a lot cleaner than it was. But the L98 with the tune port injection was the hottest engine you could get in one of these uh, IROX. Uh, this one, it runs good. It's got the uh, pause, tracking, pause traction rear differential in it, as you can see. Uh, so, don't know what the gears are, but I'll, I'll be looking that up here shortly. And of course, we had to take the T-tops out for this little drive there. Uh, previous owner there, the interior needs really cleaned up there. Uh, started a little tiny bit on it, but really gonna take everything out and clean it up. But one of the owners was gonna dye the interior and may have ruined that seat over there. So we're gonna try to clean it, uh, but most likely we'll be looking for a replacement seat there. And I think he tried to spot down there on the carpet too. So uh, it's all right, we're gonna replace the carpet anyways. Not a bad looking car for 3500 bucks. I think it's going to clean up pretty nice and make a pretty good old IROC. In the console is a copy of the RPO codes uh, that were ordered with this car. This car had, uh, um, in addition to the 350 engine and the uh, IROC option package 3, which is basically a fully loaded, as you can get, IROC 
Um, they added, the, like I said, the G80 pause attraction, the J65 four-wheel disc brakes, and the uh, power antenna. The only thing they didn't add was leather interior. Uh, I'm very surprised that it didn't have it because it's got uh, basically every other option. So it's pretty much a fully loaded uh, IROC C. down some pretty good black marks not bad for a tired old 350 okay if you enjoyed today's video please hit that like button and if you would hit that subscribe button and we'll catch you next time at rusty duck garage